Well, hello again and welcome to the Friday afternoon communique, video communique here from my office for this Friday, uh, May the 15th and this uh, May Day weekend. Uh, I made a weekend unlike one we have ever seen, at least in my lifetime I've never experienced anything quite like this. The uh, a song that came to mind, I'm a bit of a music buff as some of you know, um, as I was thinking about uh, the world in which we live, is a 1964 hit by Barbara Streisand, which was entitled simply People. Uh, the first lines, I think, of the song went like this. People, people who need people are the luckiest people in the world. And I think to myself, is that true? Um, and in fact, is it true that People need people. And I think, as, especially as we have um, been now six weeks or so or two months into this pandemic, we are increasingly realizing the truth of that statement. We do need one another. We all have this basic relational need that is built within us. Um, and we have... Uh, seen that, I think, in an increased measure in these days is that has been at least decreased for all of us, but for some has virtually been eliminated. And we see the, the impact that that has on lives. Um, my heart sometimes breaks when I realize that on, on Mother's Day that um, families could go and, 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 and see their mother up on, on a balcony uh, in, in some degree extension, but they couldn't get close. And it was just brought to mind just um, how, how significant and how substantial the need for peer personal interaction is and how this pandemic has helped us to understand or appreciate probably in an increased measure just how much we do need and cherish being with one another. It is significant. I know sometimes we like to be alone and we like our, our space, but this has shown us like no other time in history um, how much it is within us, within our nature, that we have this need to interact with other people. It was uh, God who said to Adam before the creation of Eve in Genesis chapter 2, verse 18, that it is not good that man should be alone. Uh, that's true. And I've heard as uh, from a number of people here at, at Richmond Alliance Church how um, people miss getting together as a church, uh, miss worshiping um, as one body, miss the physical presence of each other. Um, people have been doing a lot of things on Zoom, but um, I've been reading some articles with respect to that, that is still not the same as physically meeting with people. There is something missing when we're not there and flesh and blood. That's a good thing that we are discovering and increasingly um, understanding as we're going through these days, just how much and how much we value each other. And so even as a church and as a church leadership, we are now beginning to look at ways in which as the province is slowly opening up a little bit, so we as a church are asking, asking some questions in terms of how we can open up a little bit. Are there things that we can do and, 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 and strategies that we can implement that we can do some getting together? Uh, there's a number of options that we are, are beginning to look at. We meet as an, elder, as an elders team in about a week and ask you to pray for us in terms of um, how we might do that. Um, I don't think it's, it's realistic to suggest that we can't see each other for a whole year. Um, I think there are some things that we may be able to do to try to break some of those things down. And so um, just to, I would encourage you by those words that to look forward to some ways in which we as a church can, can get about a business, even though, get about our business, even though it may be in more limited ways. Having said that, I just want to say to you that I miss being with you. I come here Sunday mornings, but it's only me and Alvin. And I, I love my brother, but I, I'd like more of us to be able to get together here. And I'm looking for the day that we can do that again. I hope it's not too much longer that it's just the two of us. 
Um, but until then, um, I wish you a really good May Day weekend. Um, and find a time that maybe you can just connect with a few other people around you to encourage that need for being around people. For we truly are people who need people. God bless you.